everyone is talking about how Justin Trudeau elbowed NDP MP Ruth Ellen Brasso in the chest, including me. I can't help it. What happened in the House of Commons is like nothing I have ever seen before. And I grew up in the Ralph Klein years. Just watch. Now there is something so hypocritical about a man who claims that he's a feminist being so careless with his body around the gentler sex. I mean, Trudeau thinks that interrupting women in casual conversation is a crime of everyday sexism that needs his perpetual scolding. Here. There's lots of things you can do to be a better feminist as a man, but here's a simple one. Uh, don't interrupt women. But I guess shoving into a woman's personal space and knocking her around, even if it's inadvertent, isn't sexism. See, this is why I'm not a feminist, I can't follow their rules, I don't even know what the rules are anymore. There's just so much inconsistency. But what should really bother us the most is when Trudeau grabbed and dragged conservative whip Gord Brown. And it's really bothering me that it's not really bothering anyone else. Gord Brown was the intentional victim. The intended target of Trudeau's physical outburst and tantrum was Gord Brown a man, and no one seems especially bothered because Gord Brown is a man. Even Trudeau doesn't seem to get it. Just listen to Trudeau's apology. I would like to take a moment to apologize for two incidents that took place yesterday in this house. First, I apologize for crossing the floor in an attempt to have the member for Leeds, Grenville, Thousand Islands and Rideau Lakes take his seat. That intervention was not appropriate. It was not my role, and it should not have happened. In particular, I should not have made physical contact with the member, and I apologize to the member and to all parliamentarians for my inappropriate contact. Trudeau didn't just intervene, and he didn't just make physical contact. Trudeau tried to use brute physical force to get another person to do what he wanted, against their will. Gord Brown did not ask for Trudeau to help, and he did not want his help. In fact, Gord Brown says he told Trudeau to let him go. But Gord Brown is a man, and everyone is focused on Ruth Ellen Brasso. If one of Trudeau's taxpayer-funded nannies had grabbed one of the Trudeau kids the way Trudeau has grabbed Gord Brown, they'd be fired. And what I do know is that if Gord Brown had been Ronna Ambrose, if Trudeau had stormed out of his seat, with the pure intent to manhandle and drag a woman against her will, to use muscle to make a woman comply with his tantrum, we might be seeing a resignation today. Instead, Canadians are getting the kind of insincere apology performance we might see from a high school musical. Because Gord Brown is a man. For the Rebel.media, I'm Sheila Gunreed. Thanks for watching. Click here to never miss a Rebel update. Want even more of the Rebel? Well, click here to become a premium member.